Welcome to the band gym. Are you looking for a quick way to go ahead and hit your arms? And I don't mean just hit them. I mean train them aggressively, but a simple, super easy way to do it. You with me? Let's go ahead and take you through exactly how to do that right now. So I've got my red small quantum band hooked up to my bar. And I've got my 18 inch dowel that's one inch in diameter and I have end caps on it just to keep my hands protected, but also to just create a little buffer so the band doesn't slide off the end, which it's not going to do as long as you keep tension on the system. I'm gonna go ahead and you can do this one of two ways. If you feel pretty confident, you can go ahead and just loop the band around to do this exercise. If you wanna go ahead and avoid or make sure that the band doesn't slide off, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and loop the band back over and then I'm gonna slide the dowel through and I'm literally gonna loop the band onto the dowel. Very simple. So now, no matter what happens, the band is gonna stay connected onto the dowel. I recommend this way if you're at all apprehensive about the band sliding off. That way you eliminate it completely. From there, it's just two simple exercises. A bicep, tricep exercise. We're gonna go here and we're gonna go overhead push and then we're gonna step back switch our hands and go right into a high curl position. And then you're right back into it, right back to triceps. Just keep rocking back and forth through all both of those exercises for a designated number of sets. I typically like to go about 30 seconds on and then switch right away. Maybe give myself a little five second buffer between and I'm right back into it. And I like to flow back and forth through that for five total sets. The key will be, what band are you gonna use? Make sure you scale your band accordingly. The bicep is typically a little bit weaker muscle, but remember, you can stretch the band out because you have that variable resistance. So make sure you set a band that you can go ahead and stretch out a little bit to get the biceps, knowing that when you go to triceps, you still have more distance, you can stretch it out so that you can go ahead and get the optimal resistance for tries and the optimal resistance for buys. You with me? Enjoy this workout, guys. It's a lot of fun and it's a great way to go ahead and finish off any upper body strengthening workout.